Indian epic Ramayana talks about that there is a bridge called Rama Setu or in English they call the Adam's bridge there's a lot of reference to that even in the 1748 and the 1788 even the british they have said this is has been built by a man this is not naturally formed in a 1955 the then government in india wanted to destroy that uh, so called rama setu bridge and create a canal so therefore the ships can have a shorter period of time to go to sri lanka but in a mythological or the ancient indian epic ramayana says there is the bridge was built by rama with the help of an ape man and the people they said this is all a joke this cannot be done this must be a naturally made uh, sand uh, sand bridges that's what they all said but there are several uh, resources and uh, several uh, tests have been done and lot of scientific studies have been done and they all said this bridge was existing but now today the science channel in america did the predominantly did the maximum research on that the trailer has been released today which i will show you and they are saying this bridge has actually made by a man at least 5000 to 7000 years ago they tested they took the stones from the bridge and they did a lot of research on that and you can see this uh, soon going to be released this uh, documentary call what is on the earth now you watch this trailer and you decide yourself a nasa satellite passes over the shallow waters of the indian ocean it sends back images of a chain of largely submerged objects running between sri lanka and india It looks like a string of pearls between two islands. It looks to me like a rocky jetty, but this thing looks pretty big. On closer analysis of the satellite image, investigators calculate the line of rocks is over 30 miles long. What makes the image especially intriguing is that the rocks are in an area of sea mentioned in an ancient Hindu poem. a poem which also refers to a magic bridge their hindu legends that the god rama placed a bridge here connecting india to sri lanka the stones in the satellite image are sitting on something oceanographers call a shoal or sandbar these occur in an area where there's shallow waters and sand could accumulate between the two land masses The sandbar may be natural, but what's sitting on top of it is not. This isn't just a simple sandbar. There's objects in here that haven't been eroded away. There are stones that have been brought from afar and set on top of our sandbar island chain. How these stones got here is a mystery. And when a team of geologists date the stones, the mystery deepens. The rocks on top of the sand actually predate the sand. So there's more to the story. Scientific analysis reveals the rocks are 7,000 years old, but are sitting on top of sand that is only 4,000 years old. These results suggest the structure in the satellite image isn't natural, but built by humans. Some scholars believe the ancient texts refer to a time 5000 years ago. At this point in history, building such a long bridge would have been a superhuman achievement. So the Ramasetu bridge is giving a big boon to BJP, right? 